Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Legends of the Wind Waker HD. So, let's keep exploring and get a few more things, since we can. And there's actually some roughs down here. We also got the submarine chart, which I want to check. Okay, so we did a few of those. I can't remember which ones, but I might want to double check them. Just to make sure. It'd be nice if they got marked off once you'd had collected the treasure inside of them. But that's asking a bit much, apparently. Now, surely one of these rafts has treasure on it. Surely. Surely? Oh, hello. I think I need... Oh, hello. There is a treasure here. Oh my goodness, sea hats. This is terrifying. I'm gonna get out my arrows. I missed. I need to switch arrows back to normal. With that one. Sea hats are terrifying. Speaking of sea hats, here's one now. Oh, I got both of those with that shot? No, I didn't. That one's just crashing into things. It's so fine. That's fine. This is fine. They're so big. Oh, hey, Boko Baba Seed. Just what everyone needs. I think that's everything here then. Let's go back over to my boat. I was actually I actually thought killing the um the octo in the middle was gonna drop something, possibly. Well, there's definitely nothing from killing all the enemies here, so. Let's keep heading east, I believe. I can't see where any of the islands are. I can't even see where I'm turning. I need to use my compass. Is that the island? I think that's the island. Probably. There's also, I believe, on the submarine chart, a submarine in this last last square in the corner here. So we need to get that. Oh, hey, I could go through these things for rupees, except I have 5,000 rupees and don't need any. Oh, is that the submarine all the way over there? Wow. How are you supposed to just see that? Well, I guess I did, but also, wow, it's really far away. Based on the shadows, at least. The fog. It's fine. Now, let's check this platform and see if we can get something good from it. I really like the Great Sea as a world in Zelda. Oh, I missed. It's fine. There we go. Got on that time. There's also cannons that I need to take care of, so let's do that. That should be everything. Link's just contemplating at the moment. Let's open this up. Golden feather, perfect. Just what I need. Let's get going. Okay, so do I go to the submarine or the island? I guess the island isn't anything, so I can do that. And I don't even have the sea chart, or the the sunken treasure chart for this island. Not yet, but this is another one of those uh, constellation islands, which is cool. I really like that as a concept, just having the islands be constellations and having those constellations actually be in the sky. Ah! Camera. Camera was unhappy. Hoy, small fry. This control is very loud. Five star aisles. Have you seen it, S S small fry? The ghost ship? Because it's real. It's even been seen here in these very waters on nights when the crescent moon faces down. That's when horror rises. That's all the info I've got to offer. You know, if it turns up here right now, that'd actually be pretty good for us. I can't see where the moon is yet. Because apparently the sun and the moon are on opposite sides, which is cool, I guess. Because that means that they both orbit the planet, the Earth? I don't know. That's, that's the only thing that makes sense to me. 
Unless they're just staying still around the planet. Or like opposite sides of each other. With the Earth spinning in the middle? I don't know. I have no idea. I guess that... I don't know. Oh, there it is. It is not the right one for the ghost ship. Well, anyway, let's head over to the submarines then. The submarine. Not plural. Don't think there's going to be anything else on the rafts. Probably. Doesn't look like it, so... Let's just... Oh, there is, though. Oh, I see it, and I can't unsee it. Ah, I have to go get it. It's fine. It's probably just Boko Baba Seed. Nope, it's a red rupee, even better. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ah, I'm fine. Don't worry about me. Just go on without me. Okay, enemies. Ow. How dare you. Ah! I want that drip pendant. I have to grab it. I have to. Okay, is this the last guy? I guess so. I'm sad that that wouldn't let me stay there. Oh, drip pendant. I have to. I have to collect all of them. I have to max out every single item in the game. I guess that's, that, that's my goal now, apparently. Okay, let's open this. And we get a piece of heart. Very nice. We're getting close to the end of those. We're still a fair way off though, since we need another five heart containers. There's still so much left to do, it's honestly surprising. Uh, let's head north now, to the island that we haven't done, or had a look at, look at yet, here. So let's do that. Looks like we're directly on course. It's quite nice, really. And actually, we're getting pretty close to some scary stuff that I'm not sure how to feel about at this point in time. But I'll have to do some stuff at some point, so... Oh, hey, look out. How, how about that, then? I'm gonna go check it out before anything else, because that's just how I am. After you play randomizers, this is this is just how you are. Oh, there's whiz ropes. Ah! Full speed. Can I? Switch arrow, switch arrow. I'm bad at this. Let's head up and try to take them out from up there. Can I please? Oh my goodness. Just go up, please. Oh my goodness, how are you supposed to get up here safely? How did I miss? Let's take out these enemies. Ow. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. How many are there? What what is happening? Let's open this up while we're on fire. Boko Baba seed. Why is they protect why is this this uh, why is there this much protecting a Boko Baba seed? Is that all of them? Is that all of them? Is this incredible? Is this absolutely incredible? It is. There's nothing else here. Why is there this much protection for a Boko Bubba Seed? Why? <laughs> I guess if the items are randomly put in chests anyway. Kind of? Maybe? I don't know. Anyway, let's go to this island and get out some bait. For the fish here.
Hey, is a uh, sunken treasure here. Everything's going perfectly. All according to plan. Oi, small fry. Cliff Plateau Isles. Hey, small fry. Do you know the, about the Nintendo Gallery? The only way to, uh, in there is to hit a switch that's way up high in the Forest Haven. But the only way to do that would be to bribe one of the gulls by putting a little bait on your head. And that's all the info I've got to offer. Okay, well I might check out the Nintendo Gallery. Or I might not. Who can tell? There's a shark apparently. Hey, piece of the Triforce. Four more to go. We're getting there. Quite quickly, actually. But before we do that, let's check out this island. Since there's important stuff here to look at, and that's about it. There might be a treasure chart possibly in here to grab, but I, I don't really know, so. Let's go through here. Have all these platforms floating in the water that we need to jump between to get around. Gonna need a boomerang and a leaf. All, all of the things. Oh hey, there's a treasure chest right there, which I could, I could technically hook shot to, but I probably shouldn't. Just because of all these things blocking us, all these spikes. Oh, like the Boko Baba Seed, that's worth a lot, considering how many things would protect it. Let's go up here. And now, we need to go up here and very carefully, very carefully drop down. And walk around this treasure chest very carefully and open it up. <laughs> Joy pennant, wow. Cool. Now let's grab a stick, light it on fire, and run. Take it with us. Okay. Gotta get around and throw. Okay, so that's in place now for in a minute when I do crazy things. Probably not a minute, probably a little bit longer than that. But here is a withered tree. And also, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, which I quite possibly am, if I go up here, there should be, in between all these flowers, a blue chew. Let's take that and let's go. I wonder how many blue chews I've defeated now. Hey, treasure shot. Cool, we needed that. Okay, how many blue chews? 16 blue chews. Wow, that's a lot more than I thought there was in the game, so. Um. Where do I want to go? I think I might have a sunken treasure to get in the square above me, so let's do that. If I can. And then we'll come back for the, the with the tree at some point. I remembered something else that I missed earlier on one of the Triangle island, Islands. Because we have a, uh, a treasure chart for the south, south one. I was going to get that earlier, but I forgot. Back, back when we're going to the fairy island down there. Now where is the treasure? Where is the treasure? I'm pretty sure there's treasure here. Yeah, there is. I was worried for a second that I was wrong. Missed. Salvage. Got it. 
Might actually be worth checking the remaining things, the charts. To see which ones I haven't got yet. Silver Rupee! It's gone forever! Cool. I should probably be heading to uh, Windfall to do some stuff with my Rupees. Probably. 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 I don't think there's anything else I need to worry about right away, at least, so... There's only two squares left to reveal. Which would be good. I have no idea how much is actually left on Windfall, though. Is the real problem. Although I can think of... A few things that I can probably do. Just a few. I'm not entirely... The most memorable... Memorable? I don't know what I'm trying to say. I don't remember a lot of the stuff to do here. Oh, I can, I can think of a few things, I guess. But anyway. Let's go see what we can do. I might need to check if the auction house still has anything left for us, which I don't think it does, but it might. And that scares me. But what I do want to do is actually go up here. And up here. And I want to... Hit this button back here. Could have done that a long time ago, but I didn't really have much need to do it. And now the wind blowing into it will make it... make it turn, so that's pretty cool. Okay. Let's... Figure out what, our, what else I wanted to do. You're selling stuff that I could look at. Or... <sighs> options. Too many options. Who thought options was a good idea? Oh my gosh. <laughs> the things I could do right now. Uh, I guess... I'm tempted to start looking at the stuff he's got, but I really need to look up a guide. Kind of? Kind of. Can I not read the sign? Okay. That's the way it's gonna be. Let's go in. This should be the school. Welcome to Miss Murray's School of Joy. I don't think I've ever seen your face around here before, my young scholar. Are you a new pupil? What can I do for you this fine day? We need to talk. I know I may look a bit flashy for a teacher, but I assure you, I am one. How long has it been since I opened my school here on Windfall Island? Twenty years. Ever since then, I've been teaching the children of this island about true joy. But I do have a rather joyless problem. There's this delinquent gang of four young boys who never listen to a word I say. Even though I wait patiently for those boys to show up, they never come. It's as if, it's as if they don't want joy in their hearts. Could you please catch their leader, that little boy named Ivan, and talk some sense into him for me? Please, young man, for me? Yes, ma'am. Oh, thank you so much. You're such a dear. They're such troublesome little boys. I'm at my wit's end over over how to handle them. But they won't be so mean to a boy their own age, will they? I think they... <laughs> I should think not. Good luck, young man. Well, we have a goal now, so let's see if we can do it. At all. You look like a goody two-shoes, and we hate goody two-shoes. You can't go walking around our town pretending to be all big. Yeah! Yo, bud! You got a problem with us killer bees, huh, do ya? Don't tell me that it's that annoying hag of a teacher again, is it? You came here to give us a talking to, cause Miss Murray asked you to, right? Tell us not... Uh, not to skip school, right, bud? Tell us to be tardy, right, bud? Well, forget all about it. We're the mighty and invincible gang of four the killer bees. Do you think we'd listen to a chump like you? But I'll tell you what, bud. If you want to challenge us to a competition, then we'll think about maybe listening to a, <laughs> a little bit. What do you say, bud? Do you want to challenge us? I'll take you on. 
Okay, your funeral, bud. The simple... The, 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 ah, my goodness. How did I do that? The rules are simple. We're gonna go hide somewhere, and if you find us, we're gonna run. You gotta try to catch us. Easy as that, bud. We won't hide indoors or nothing. And we won't leave this island. So look for us around in the shadows and behind buildings and stuff. If you catch all four of us, we lose. You got it, bud? Ready? Go! So now we need to find them. Which should be a time. Let's start by going over here. There's one. But of course we also have to catch them after we find them, so... It's not too simple. Unfortunately. Just need to roll into them. You're awesome! Yes, I know. Now... Where would the rest be? Well, if we go over this way... All the way up here... There's one back here. And there he goes. Still need to go catch him. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Got him. Gah, you got me. Okay, just two more left. Shouldn't be too hard, right? Just need to go... Sidle back here, if I can. Please. Please, thank you. Go, 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 go. Oh, hey, look at that. Need to hop up on this ledge, though. Hello. And there he goes. Well, once we catch this one, there will just be one left. Just have to wait for all these cutscenes. Don't... what? Catching... Can't you see we're busy? I know we're super cute and all, but that doesn't mean you can just come up and talk to us whenever you like. Jeepers. I'm just trying to roll. Where'd he go? Oh, there. Got him. Aw, oh, lame. What's the matter, mister? Why are you looking at us like we're aliens or something? Weird like that. What? We're good girls. We don't sp spread rumors. Hmm. Stop, please, I'm trying to roll. Yeah, we're good. No matter how much money you give us, we won't tell you anything. Nope, nothing. That's right, not even for two rupees. Have some rupees. Oh, really? You're gonna give us rupees? Yippee, we all- we can't- you each get one whole rupee. Ha, ah, we're still not going to tell you anything. Not even a teensy tiny rumor. Yeah, we'd never tell you that if you bring Lenzo a picto box, He'll be super happy and even show you his upstairs gallery. I guess grown-ups like having friends who have the same hobbies, too. Must be lonely being a grown-up. That's why I will never grow up. Okay, I can roll now. Freedom at last. Let's roll into this tree. Please. Close enough. There's the last one. And there he goes. Please let me go. Roll. Got him. Yeah, you got me. Ah, I can't believe it. You found all four of us, and you caught us all too. Talk about utter defeat. Looks like we lost our touch, killer bees. I guess maybe it's time we chilled out from now on. We won't cause no more trouble for anyone. And to reward your hide and seeking skills, here, take this, bud. Piece of heart. We could have got this a long time ago. Increased by one, we have 16 hearts, just four more to go. Ah, this is our favorite possession, but you've proven that you're worthy. To our bud, the hide and seek master. Oh, and one more thing. We need you to apologize to Miss Murray for us, all right? We're counting on you, bud. Okay. And now they're gonna follow me around forever. What can I do you do for you on this fine day? We need to talk. You did it, didn't you? 
You said something to those delinquents for me, didn't you, dear? You can't fool me. I watched it all from the shadow of my door. That's not weird. You really are, dear. You fill me with joy. I have to reward you. So here's a little spare change. <laughs> Purple rupee. Gone to the void forever. Oh, and one more thing. Don't tell anybody, dear. Okay, goodbye. Hey, sounds like you apologized to teach us, teach for us. Ah, uh, good old Miss Murray. And speaking of Bud, did you know it's gonna be Miss, uh, Mrs. Murray's birthday soon? Boss, oh boss, you think maybe we should give her some kind of present or something? Don't be stupid, we're the killer bees. We ain't no teacher's pets. Yeah, but... Teach loves uh, jewelry and junk more than anything else in the world. What's she into these days? What's she call them? Joy pendants? Really? Where do you find them? Are they just lying around? If we could just uh, find some, we could give them to teach as a present and she'd be all happy. Hey, now that I think about it, uh, when I was climbing trees the other day, I saw some sparkly lights. Up on the top of some tree in town. Where was that? Maybe the that's one of the damn pendants. What'd you think, boss? Nah, that's crazy talk. Is there a joy pendant on the top of one of the trees? Can I can I roll into a tree and find it? Is this a real thing I didn't know about? I have to know now. I have to know. Ah, don't roll off. It's not that one. Oh, I can't reach that one. Where, where, oh, that one's back there. Wow, I can't reach that at all. I don't think it's going to be on top visibly, maybe. And I have to do something else to do it. Get it. But I don't know. Because I've not really heard this before. I don't think, at least. But then, I don't know which tree. Unless it's the one over there. Seems to be the only one left at this point, other than the one I can't really reach. Unless it's the one that I rolled into a- there it is. Cool. Got a joy pendant. Yo, bud, looks like you found yourself a joy pendant. Solid work. Actually, I gotta admit, we hid that thing up in the tree. We thought you might find it. Listen up, it's gonna be Miss Murray's birthday soon. We're- we were thinking of giving her a present, so if it- it was a, it was good that we finally got our hands on that thing. But we can't be going around giving the presents to people. No way. That's just not. Uh, that j just doesn't fit the killer bee's style. Come on, bud. Can't you give it to teach for us? Can't you? And it's not like we could ask any, just anybody to do it for us. Neither. It's got to be someone reliable who can keep a secret. You're the only one we could who we we could ask, bud. Well, I guess we know what we need to do. Hmm. Well, let's go... See what we can do then. Oh, I went the wrong way. Okay. What can I do for you on this fine day? Is talk. When it comes to children, my eyes never deceive me. Someday, dear, you will grow up to be a fine young man, and your name will go down in history. That's what I think, dear. Well, let's give you some joy pennants since we have 76 of them. Oh, dear, my dear, that's a joy pendant. To tell you the truth, I love jewelry above all else, and that... Uh, why? That is ex extremely rare and hard to come by. It's the hottest thing around, dear. Oh my, yes. I will happily take a single one from you. No, no, I insist. Only one. To tell you the truth, I'd actually like about 20 of them. But that would probably only happen in my wildest, dr uh, wildest of dreams. You know, I've been a teacher here for a long time. It's tough to put uh, one past me. 
That being said, I'm pretty sure I know who put you up to this, dear. Those little sweeties. I'm so joyful. It's the best birthday present I could ask for. I suppose I ought to thank you. Uh, you. Close your eyes, dear. <laughs> Red rupee. Another 20 rupees into the void. If you see those boys again, tell them I say hello. Oh, hey. I've got more. You're still wearing one now. My dear, did you bring me joy pennants yet again? How many joy pennants do you have right now? 75? Why, to think a child like you would pay such a large tribute to me. Oh, your teacher is very impressed by your efforts, little dear. My whole body is numb with a thrill of excitement. So this is what pure joy feels like. I'll take precisely 20 of them. Thank you. That will do just fine. My heart will be all a flutter. I don't know if you know, but 20 is my lucky number. And just as I promised, I will reward you for going out of out and collecting all these for me. I'm going to give you a wonderful, splendid thing. Close your eyes, dear. You got the cabana deed. It's written on yellowed parchment. It looks quite old. Da da dum da. You see, although I am but a mere teacher, I own a ver my own very own cabana in a tropical oasis down south. But lately, I haven't made use of it at all, so you have to, you, so you can have it. <laughs> it's alright, dear. You can stop gaping in amazement now. Now that you have this deed, that cabana is all yours. You own it. So whatever you do, don't lose this piece of paper. I'm getting on an eight in, on in age. And uh, sea travel hasn't exactly agreed with me as of late. Now I can just stay here and relax as I continue my work with the children. And just so you know, you'll find the place southeast of here. It's on a tiny, lonely little island near the Triangle Islands. From now on, it is your own little bachelor pad. Good luck finding it. What? Oh, and one more thing. Don't tell anybody, dear. Hmm, are you going to give me these as well? But I told you uh, I was perfectly sa satisfied with the 20 you gave me before. But my, you're such a persistent little dear. Since you're so insistent, I will uh, accept them happily. Fine, I have no choice but to unleash pure joy on you. Prepare for an onslaught of joy, like the likes of which you've never imagined. How many joy pennants have you brought? 55? My goodness, when I put these together with the other ones, you've already brought, brought me... They add up to a whopping 76. Oh, thank you, thank you. I'm so joyful. To receive so many mountains of these beautiful pennants, I'm quite simply brimming with joy, my dear. To thank you, I have to, I have to give you my most precious of precious belongings. I shall give you this. Now close your eyes, dear. This item is so rare. There are sparse others like it anywhere in the world. A treasure chart. Open this chart. Oh my goodness, the church chart for all that. What do you think? Doesn't it fill you with joy? I found it a long time ago in that cabana that now belongs to you. But, my, but why the long face? I understand, my dear. I really do. You're just sw welling up with joy at having done such a good deed, aren't you? You mustn't forget this feeling, you hear? Not ever. Not for any reason. Well, there we go. That's all of our joy pennants gone. I don't even know if that's everything that would, we would get from her. There might even be more, so I don't know. We will have to probably get more to find out, but I think that's probably everything. Oh, there it is. Number 25 is... Is that the Forsaken Fortress? I think it is. Wow. Guess we'll have to head there for another treasure. See how that goes. But anyway, that's one thing taken care of. Let's head on up this way. Actually, I think that's probably it for now. So thank you all for watching. And I'll see you all next time.